Welcome to another edition of Chaplain John with Chaplain John Sayers, featuring special reports and interviews with people doing kingdom ministry in Tulare County and beyond. And now, here's Chaplain John. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I guess this thought for the day might be uh, why we have a flag or why we say a pledge of allegiance to the flag. Um, the other day, well, last week, we've always had a flag out outside and we believe it was these two little kids live next door to us. We think they did it because they pulled it down and they broke the stand that it was on. I mean, it was on and they just yanked it down. When we found out about it, I know that Gail said, guys, did you pull down the flag? And they, oh, and they ran into the house. And then I saw them an hour later outside playing and I just looked at the flag and where it was and it was somebody pulled our flag down. And they looked at me and they go, and they ran into the house. We're pretty sure it was them. And then I got to thinking, maybe they didn't understand why we put the flag up there. Maybe thought it, they thought it was just a decoration, we'll tear it down. I wonder if that's what people think when we um, show our, the flag. Uh, by the way, I was gonna show you this. This is kind of cool. This, ugh, when my father died and my dad was uh, in the Navy, uh, in fact, we put his, this is his Navy hat. We put it on this. I remember we had a military service for dad. Now dad died uh, uh, after mom and I, and it was a military service. I've conducted a lot of these. I didn't, this one, I was just a son with along with my sisters. And I knew that somebody was gonna get the flag. It was gonna be my oldest sister, Joanne. That's who it should have gone to. But the person conducting the service gave it to me. Now, it wasn't in this case. They got, they all got this really case with my dad's name down here. Um, and, and later on, I found that my sisters all agreed they wanted me to have it. What an honor. So I have dad's flag and, with his Navy hat. And we have that displayed in our house where we all can see it. But, but why even the flag? Why do we do this? And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to sit down with these little girls when they're outside playing. Oh, a little boy and a little girl. And they're probably kindergarten this year. No, nah, they may be a little older. Um, because maybe they don't understand why we have a flag. It's not just a decoration, is it? See, that I want to share with them that the stars on the flag represent all of our states. I remember when we just had 48 stars. Wow. And then we added two more, Alaska and Hawaii, and so now there's 50. And the, uh, the stripes represent the original 13 colonies. I mean, that's pretty rich. But why we have it and why we say Pledge of Allegiance um, is because we are one nation. And that flag reminds us we're one nation under God. Now, yes, the under God part was added later, but we say it now. Boy, if you want to hear a powerful message on the Pledge of Allegiance and the flag, Google Red Skeleton. Yeah, the Red Skeleton, the comedian, great man. Uh, his understanding of the uh, flag. But I want to sit down I, when the girls and the little boy and little sister are outside. I want to sit down. They say, sit down, because I want to share with you about this flag. They may not know why we display the flag. Yes, we're not a perfect country, but, we're, but we have the freedom to, to strive to be perfect. Yes, I know people are saying, well, did you know George Washington had slaves? Yes, I knew that. But also, if you read the integrity of George Washington, that, that what he, he, I really truly believe he knew that wasn't right. Um, and in time, in time, our country was going to uh, stop having slaves, even if it took a war. And it did, didn't it? The Civil War. And are we perfect today? No, we're not. You know, 
But I look at a flag and I do pledge allegiance. I pledge allegiance to God first, always God. I pledge allegiance to the, and then to the flag, to the United States of America, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. That's why we have a flag. Hmm. That's my longer thought for the day. Can't wait to sit down and share with these little kids why we have a flag. I wonder how many of us have forgotten why we share our flag. God bless.